Now, at first glance, it may seem like I have 3D printed another SD10 TSM Monopoly piece. But in fact, I made a fully functional mini SD10 tornado siren scaled up from the SD10 Monopoly piece. Even as a stand, too. Yes, I actually did make a mini SD10. And no, I haven't given up on the mini Thunderbolt yet. That I'm still working on that. I haven't given up on it yet. As you can tell, it's clearly not to scale with the mini SD10. Yes, the mini SD10 is way bigger. Um, but I've had some speed issues with the mini SD10. Mainly might be because the motor I'm using is the old shot motor from the mini Thunderbolt's blower. And I recently uh, rejigged the rotator on the mini Thunderbolt, so it uses a smaller motor. So now I have the motor from the rotator to use on the blower. I'll update that in a separate video. I'll do a mini Thunderbolt update in a separate video, but this video is about the mini SD10, which unfortunately is not very loud. But um, uh, the mini SD, the real full-size SD10 isn't as loud as the real full-size Thunderbolt, so I guess it kind of adds up. So I'm gonna set the camera down here somewhere so you can hear what it sounds like. I can't really get it up to full speed for some reason, but I can get it almost there. Let me move the mini Thunderbolt out of the way. So I'll just use this AC adapter I have here. So I just used some spare wire I had from the mini Thunderbolt to wire up the chopper motor in the mini SD10. Here's a little close up. Inside there is the chopper and stator spaced out from the inside of this ring thing right here just like the real thing. All 3D printed on my Creality CR10 Hicktop 3D printer I got for Christmas and that um, uh, was obviously a few months ago. After some failed attempts I managed to get it to work like a piece of some pieces broke uh, as I was uh, making them. Or I was removing the support material from the stand once here and it snapped right off. Couldn't get the support material out of this chopper because it was like too stuck in there. Hopefully one day I can get it to be a little bit louder. It might just be a, a chopper design fail. I mean the fins may need to be rejigged if you know what I mean. Maybe I need to rejig the fins and the fan part of the chopper. You know, the blades that are inside the chopper, I need to rejig those maybe so that way they blow a little bit more air. Or maybe I have like too much blockage towards one of the ports because... Uh, let me show you one. Chopper, see here are the ports. That's what they look like. There's like this wall right here. Maybe the air is having trouble getting through like it gets stuck there as it gets thrown out. So maybe I need to have it a little more even. Can't really see, it won't focus. I'm going to manually focus it. All right, now that we're focused, you can see how the chopper's blades are. And it spins this way. This one broke, as you can see in there. You can see how the support material came off, like, really nasty on the top there. I'm now going to do a distance test with the Mini SD10. Plug the AC after in and then wire it up. Crap. Power bar.
Now let's do a behind a wall test. Me and the camera's gonna go in the room while this thing goes off.